Okay, so hello and welcome to another live session with Severdale Specialist Academy in Shrewsbury Town in the community. We've got S5 joining us for their third lesson on reaction. So if we could bring everyone into the session, that would be fantastic. So we've got William, Carl and Lucas. They're all ready to rumble for their last session. So give everyone a big wave at home. There we go. Fantastic. All, re all ready to go. So if we can have our first slide up, please. That would be fantastic in terms of equipment. So what do you need? An open space, a drink again to keep yourself hydrated, a partner to play the game. Okay, two objects and also football, tennis ball, sponge ball, and that's just to show progression within the game. So if we could have our next slide, our learning outcomes. So to be able to use reaction skills in, in competitive games, to be able to understand how to make the game competitive and include everyone and then to show fair play in a competitive game which is really important in sport and i'm sure william carl and lucas will do just that so first game that we're going to play before we come on to the skills um we're going to go straight into the the session how it's going to complete in the game of scoops so if we can watch the screen really really closely for the game Okay, so hello, welcome to lesson three of reactions. We're going to look at putting it into a competitive game. I'm going to show the principles of the game with myself, but there will be somebody playing against me if I was playing within the competitive game. So again, still focusing on the reactions, being set, being ready, being focused, good listening skills, especially when we're playing the competitive game of scoop. So how scoop works is an object that is placed in front of you, playing with a partner, it will be placed about five paces away so there's no clashing when you go to grab the cone. I am going to do different movements, for example, on the spot, and then when I get the call of scoop, I'm going to scoop the cone up as quickly as I possibly can, reacting to the call. Okay, so I'm going to do the first move, it's going to be jumping, and then we're going to go into grabbing the cone. There'll be the person opposite you doing the exact same movement. First person to get it will get a point. Okay? Scoop. Okay, so there we go. So I managed to react really quickly. If I was to play against someone else, and no, then I picked it up quicker than them, I get the point and not them. Okay? And there's different variations of the game that you can try. So I'm going to try a different movement. I'm going to progress it a little bit higher. So I'm going to do hopping. And I'm going to wait for the call of scoop. Scoop. Okay, and then I've reacted to the cone. You can start different distances away. So you could start five paces away and then doing the movement. And then you've got to react and run in and collect the cone. Okay, so stay safe, enjoy, and good luck. Okay, then, so fantastic. So as Carl, Har Carl, Lucas and William have just seen the game, they're all set up and ready to play. So we're going to go with a movement to start with, like I did. We will go with jumping. And then when you hear the call of scoop, you will pick up the cone or piece of equipment that you have. So, for example, it could be a book, it could be a cone, it could be a ball. It is entirely up to what equipment you've got available to you. So we'll go with jumping to begin with okay fantastic are we ready so we'll go jumping then to jump in jump in and scoop yeah good reactions well done good listening skills okay so if you're playing against someone at home if you've got it first give yourself a point good start so we'll go jump in again to jump in jump in and scoop good well done excellent work good work okay, remember to keep your score okay, it's important. we can play the game inside or out if the weather's good I advise you to go outside and enjoy the good weather okay so one more one more with jumping okay jump in, jump in as high as we can jump in as high as we can can we touch the clouds and scoop Good. Well done, S5. Great work. Excellent work. So now we will go running on the spot. So we'll go running, you can do fastly or just a little gentle jog on the spot. Okay. Okay, fantastic. So off we go then running on the spot then. Running on the spot. Running on the spot. Great work. Great work. And scoop. 
Yes. <laughs> oh, what reactions. Well done. Good work. Excellent work. Okay. Are we ready then? Running on the spot then? Running on the spot. Running on the spot. Running on the spot. Running on the spot. And scoop. Scoop. Yay. Excellent reactions. Well done. Hey, one more. One more of running. Okay. So one more of running. Hey, running. Running. And scoop. Good. Well done. Okay. Now we're going to change it up ever so slightly. Okay. So ever so slightly. So well, I'm going to call out two different movements. So two different movements. Okay. So we're going to go with running. If I say running, you run. If I say jump, you jump. And then when I say scoop, you scoop the piece of equipment. Okay. So you've got to react now to the change of movement. Okay. So. We go running on the spot, running on the spot, running on the spot, running and jumping, jumping, jumping and running, 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 not scoop, not scoop yet, and scoop, scoop, yeah, good, excellent work, well done, okay, okay then, so running again. Hey, jump in. And run in. And scoop. Scoop. Oh, yes, that's five. Like it. Excellent work. Okay, one more. And I'm going to ask you which movements you would like to add in. Okay, are we ready then? Run in. Jump in. And scoop. Oh, good. Excellent work. Really well done. Okay, so if you could just come walk into the camera. Okay, so we'll go on to the, the drink and think slide, please. Okay, so fantastic. So then, so our drink and think time. Okay, so how, so what, what skills, so Carl, Carl, if you'd like to come closer, a little closer to the camera, okay. So, what did you have to do to react successfully? So, in that game we've just played, what did you do to react? What did you have to do? Listen. You have to li great answer. So you had to listen to the call. So fantastic answer, Carl. Lucas, what else did we have to do to be to do to do well within the game? <laughs> Be ready. Be ready. So we had to be ready, didn't we? Yes. Yeah, so we had to be ready and on the spot. So we were running, and then we have to be ready. To grab an excellent answer. Or which was your favorite? Or which was your favorite? Which was your favorite movement that you did, William? So did you prefer to do the jumping, the jogging, or the hopping? Uh, yeah. Jumping, good answer. Okay, so you, you did really well. Then you're jumping, and then you reacted to the question of the or the call of scoop. Okay, so really well done. We're now going to make it a little bit harder. Okay, so if we could go on to the how to ways to make the game harder slash easier. Okay, so you could add in equipment to complete the skills such as dribbling. Okay, so that's where the where at the start it said if you've got footballs, etc., you can add them in. You can add a point scoring system in. So like we've already introduced that, so we're progressing really well. And then stand five paces away um, from the cone, so you must react to run and pick it up. And that is the one we're going to try now. So as you can see, I've got it set up in here for my for the cone. I've got it set up in the middle. At the front room, and I'm going to stand five paces away. I'm going to still complete the movement, okay? And when I shy, scoop, I'm going to run in and try and scoop the cone up as quickly or piece of equipment as quickly as I possibly can. Okay, so it's just like standing five paces back and then completing the movement. And when you run in, scoop and grab the cone. Okay, so are we ready? Are we set? Okay, so make sure there's still the distance between you and your partner, still the gap of two or three paces, just so that you don't collide with each other. Okay, are we ready? Are we ready? So we'll go with a two movement. 
of we'll go running and jumping to begin with. Okay, are we ready? Okay, so running on the spot, running on the spot, jumping, jumping. Excellent work, excellent work, and scoop, scoop. Yeah. The reactions well done. Excellent work by everyone. Okay, so place the cone back down. You're standing a little bit further away. Fantastic. So we'll go jumping. Okay, hopping. Good and scoop, scoop to go, 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 go. Yes, well done. Excellent work. Okay, one more, and then I'm going to ask someone to add a different movement that we could use. Okay, so jogging, jogging on the spot, jogging on the spot, jogging on the spot, hopping. Hopping and scoop, scoop, scoop. Yeah. Yes, good. Okay, so I'm going to ask Carl. Carl, which? So if you could go and just just do it in, fantastic. What movement could we do instead of jumping, mm. hopping, or running on the spot? What other movement could we do? Turn around. Turn around, so we could do. Turn around. Say turn around. Turn back. Turn around. Okay, fantastic. Great suggestion, Carl. And that is one that everyone could try at home as well. So if we go back, we're going to add in turn around as well. Okay. Are we ready? Great answer. Great work. Okay. So jogging on the spot. Jogging on the spot. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Good. Turn around. All right, there we go. And scoop, scoop, go, 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 go. Yeah. Good. Really well. So as you can see from the answers given earlier on, this is skills are really important to the game. Also being set being ready to be able to react to the to grab the piece of equipment. Okay, let's go. Okay, jogging on the spot. Okay, hopping. Jump in, turn around, turn around, and scoop, scoop, go, 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 yeah, yeah. that's good, okay, now we're going to add in a point scoring system between Lucas, Carl, and William to see who can react first to be able to get the piece of equipment, and if you do so, we will give you a point, so I know you've been having competitive games against your partner, okay, but now we're going to add in the playing against each other. So Lucas, William and Carl, are we ready? Are we ready? ready and set? Okay, so jumping on the spot then. Jumping on the spot. Jumping. <laughs> oh, not scoop yet. Not scoop yet. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Hop in. Hop in. Hop in and scoop. <laughs> I think Carl got that one first. Okay, good work. Well done. Okay, great work. Okay, so we can place the we place the comb back down. Hey, okay, good work. Are we set and ready? Okay, good. Jogging, jogging on the spot. So the last few then, last few jogging on the spot. High knees. We go high knees. So change it up again. High knees. High knees and scoop. <laughs> Lucas. Okay, so Lucas has got a point. Carl has got a point. Okay, well done. Good work. Are we ready? Okay, good. Jogging on the spot. Okay. Jogging on the spot. Jogging on the spot. High knees. High knees. High knees. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. And scoop. In your bed. Hey, William. I think William was just about got that one first. We've all got a point each okay okay really really good work okay so last go last go so carl are you gonna put, put if you pop the comb back down good man okay are we ready yeah jump in jump in turn around high knees high knees jogging on the spot and scoop <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was close. That was very close between all three people there. So all three participants. So really good effort. 
by William, Carl and Lucas. If you could bring it in to the, to the, to the screen, that would be fantastic. Excellent work by everyone. Okay, so William, if you go a little bit closer to the screen, fantastic. So then really well done within the session, okay? Excellent work across all three lessons and hope you've really enjoyed it. And I hope everyone who's been watching at home has really enjoyed it. It's really important to remember that you can do the activities indoors or outdoors if the weather is good, okay? But we just ask a question, a couple of questions, okay? So what, over any of the lessons that you've taken part in, or today, last um, Tuesday, or last Thursday, which was your favorite part? Carl, we'll go to you first. The, the code? The, 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 game, the game we've just played now, the scoop game. Yeah. Okay, fantastic. So Carl's really enjoyed the scoop game. He did really good reactions. Lucas, which was your favorite game or favorite activity? Number games. What was that? Number Sorry, games. Lucas? Number games. Talk. Numbers game. Yeah. Numbers game. So so when so when you had to so you're good, Lucas. Okay. So when you had to react to the different numbers, okay, and that was a really good game. We all did really well within that one. So we'll ask William now, which is your favourite game, William? Yesterday's. Yesterday's activity. Yeah. Fantastic. Okay. And we all did again. We did really, really well. And Patrick with Patrick was really impressed with doing the right left and how you were able to react to that. We had a really good E lesson. So well done. A massive well done to William, Carl, and Lucas for completing the three lessons. You've done really, really good work and shown good progression. So well done. Take care and stay safe, everyone. Yeah, Thank, Thank you. you.